Now there is about, about, I sounded Irish right there, about, we are about to get into some pops. <laughs> Sorry. to another video. Today we are going to be unboxing the entire set of Sons of Anarchy Pops. Funko Pops. <laughs> um, I'm really pumped. All of these are pretty affordable for the most part. There's only five in the whole set, all of which are vaulted, so uh, they're not coming out again. But they're all really a hundred bucks and under except for one of them, and we got three of them which are signed. I'm really excited. Really pumped. Before anybody asks, this is for my personal collection, so they're not going to be for sale. Sorry, but I mean, I'm a little bit more excited about it because I'm not like getting rid of these. Uh, we're going to be taking them out, getting a closer look. I'm really pumped. I did enjoy the show a lot. However, it was kind of like a botched background show for me. Um, there were parts where I, I sat down and watched like a few episodes and binged at certain times, but for the most part, I was doing something else while this was on in the background. I do that a lot. So either way, for the most part, I really enjoyed it and I'm just pumped to have the set. I got it at a good price and a few of them are signed without the certificate. And for my personal collection, I don't really care all that all that much because again, I don't plan to sell them. Just a little quick reminder about tonight's chat. It will be at 9 p.m. Eastern right here on my channel, House of a Thousand Pops, if you, you know, don't know where you are right now. Um, we are going to be having on, and I know you've heard so many things about the app. You've just like heard the nonstop name of the app, and I'm sure you know what I'm going to say before I say it. What not? Yep. We're going to have Logan on tonight. I'm super excited to just dig in and ask some questions. I got a lot of them. So join us tonight, 9 p.m. right here. And as usual, you know, if you like today's video, hit that like button and feel free to hit that subscribe if you're not already in the little notification bell. All that good stuff. All right, let's open some SOA Pops. Pretty bumped. All right. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that packing, first off. Like foam, like actual, like this is, this is packing. Better be for this. Okay, so, um, there's six of them in here and I forgot because one of them is just him and then the other one is signed. But um, anyways, five in the entire set and we can start with this lovely lady. All right, so you're gonna be a problem here. All right, cool. So our first beautiful girl out, and I think these are all but one in a soft protection. That's because this one is technically out of the collection. Um, he bought it separately, but no, we'll go through it. All right, so. Our first little gem out is literally hmm, Miss Gemma. I love her. Now, so she's not one of the signed ones that I have. Her and one of the other characters are not signed. So I absolutely love Gemma. I mean, Gemma's one of the most bad ASS chicks in that entire show. When she kill Tara like what I mean she just did an awesome job with this role everything about it her character I mean you didn't mess with that mom absolutely crazy I love her she I mean her character just I couldn't imagine anybody else for that role she did so well but big mama bear out of the group uh let's see I'm gonna grab the other, other, other one. All right. Next one we have out. Ooh, all right. And we got our little, you know, a little tip. A little tip. If you ever send puffs in like hard stacks, it's super considerate to tape the bottom so that I don't pull it out and. You know, the pop doesn't come flying out. 
Although the last video with uh, like the $700 pop not being in a hard stack, we could just be lucky that we got one at all. Um, all right, so the next bad boy out is Clay. I think it's Morrow. Morrow is how you say their last name, but whatever. So Clay, now I have to be honest, Clay's kind of creepy. I didn't love his character. Um, I was kind of hoping for his uh, death at some point and pretty pumped that Jax was the one to do it. Um, I mean, he was just kind of creepy. I didn't love him. He, and I, I think that was the point. I don't know that many people loved Clay throughout the seasons, but he, I wasn't a fan of him. But it is a cool pop. I don't mind it at all. I think they did a really good job, actually, in the realm of, like, when they do the people pops. I think they did uh, a better job with him. Than most and they did a really good job with the texture of his hair too you could even see that that's pretty cool so along with the that bad boy we have the same clay but this one is signed and this is the seven bucks a pop uh, i think it was a hundred of them signed by ron perlman this one is jsa authenticated i lied one of them is authenticated all right so along with that those you know those ones. Next one out, we will do, oh, this is my second favorite character in the entire show. Mr. Opie Winston. I mean, who didn't love Opie? So this one is signed. He was one of, I mean, just the best characters that like, I feel like with emotional, that people were really emotionally attached to, if that makes sense. Um, but Opie was played by Ryan Hurst. And if you don't know, like, if you can't picture where he's been, he played Chick in Bates Motel, which is really one of my favorite shows that I've watched that had, like, that creepy horror background. But anyways, Opie in this, I mean, when he died, and I think everybody can agree, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Balling for ever so sad he uh got beat to death in the prison right something like that but <laughs> so sad this was definitely the most emotionally painful um uh, death to to have on the show for myself um but <laughs> just <with Opie. laughs> all right and of course we got I mean, we gotta save the best for last. So where is this one? All right, so we will pulled out the signed one. So again, all of these, I believe, are like 70 and under for the most part. Uh, I think Clay is like 30 bucks. Opie, I think is like 70 and Gemma is around like 40 bucks or so. So the next pop we have out is Mr. Jax and he is the only one out of these that has, um, two pops. So the first one we have out is Mr. Jax Teller. And this one is signed, but not authenticated along with the Opie. Um, but this is the cheaper Jax as he's about a hundred bucks, I think. Um, and I mean, this box is still slightly damaged, so he's not going anywhere anyways, but I love Jax. I mean, first off, Everybody loved Jax. I mean, I don't care what kind of guy or girl you were into. Like, you loved Jax, no matter what. But he did such a great job, again, with this character. And, I mean, him killing... Well, first off, him killing Clay was my favorite, like, character against character. I That was a huge fan of his death. Um, but... Hold really quick. We're going to pull out our second Jax here before I go on rambling about him. And this bad boy, this is a convention exclusive one. He's peep, oh my, he's up to like a little over 500, I believe. But uh, the difference in pop is really just like hat and glasses. Like I said, Jax... I mean, Opie's death probably affected me still a little bit more, but I never would have thought, I guess, that Jax would kill himself. I never would have thought he would have killed Gemma, too. But I guess 
it all makes sense. Well, guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. We went through this wonderful little set. I, again, am, this is mine, keeping this for myself. We are not selling this, but I'm really pumped to have it. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed seeing them out of box. Some of these were really cool. Like, I mean, much more detailed, I guess, than you would think initially just looking at them through the box, which I feel like most people only do. But if you liked today's video, again, hit that thumbs up button. And if you didn't, well, you know, you know. Why do you, like, why do you come back? I feel like there's a lot of people that just like come back just to like hit that dislike button. Like less than a minute after posting. It's like one person just coming in there. Oh, I hope I hope it fulfills your day to hit that button when I post. I will try to post more often so that um, you have more things to do with your day. But once again, don't forget we have Logan from Whatnot on tonight, 9 p.m. Eastern, right here. Like in a little bit after you see this. So feel free to come hang out with us tonight and chat, learn some things. And if you don't know about whatnot, well, you will learn a lot tonight. And if you are, you know, sick of hearing about whatnot, you should come anyways, because there's a lot of good information. I feel like anybody can really get some use out of whatnot. So come hang out, come check it out. But I love you guys. And I mean, as always, just have like a great I would say a couple days, but there's never a guarantee that I'm actually going to post on time. But let's hope for a video on Friday. Before we end this video, though, I just want to throw out like a quick little sneak peek. Uh, there's a good, there's a good possibility I will also be on whatnot as like a pop up on Tuesday. Not so much as a pop up because I'm telling you about it beforehand, but like pop up is in I'm not going to be scheduled. So if you're not following me on whatnot, go and do so so that you can get notified. But I love you guys so much. I hope you have a great rest of your week, and I will hopefully see you on Friday.